Hi, this is Sean here from the Tour Guide. I'm going to show you how to get from Paris City Center to this place behind me, Versailles. Located about 24 kilometers or about 11 miles away from Paris, the palace was originally built by Louis XIII as a hunting lodge. It wasn't turned into a palace until Louis XIII's son, the famous Louis XIV, decided to do so. The Chateau of Versailles housed the kings and queens of France until they were chased out in 1789 during the French Revolution. But luckily for us, the palace still stands in all of its glory. However, because it's so popular, make sure you're prepared. The estate of Versailles spreads over more than 2,000 acres, around 800 football fields, divided into three areas, the palace, the gardens, and the Trianon. So remember, to get the most out of your visit to Versailles, buy tickets in advance and arrive early. You want as much time as possible to explore the palace and the gardens without feeling rushed and without being shoulder to shoulder with other people. This piece of history deserves your undivided attention. So with the right information and a bit of planning, it's well worth the trip. How to get to Versailles from Paris. The Chateau of Versailles is not actually in Paris, but in the city of Versailles, France. There are three ways to get to Versailles from Paris. By train, use the RERC to get to Versailles Chateau Rive Gauche train station. Once here, you're about 10 minute walk to the palace, but signs will clearly indicate which way to go. From central Paris, you have many RERC stations. You need to buy a special metro ticket to get to and from Versailles. A round trip ticket will cost 7 euros and 10 cents as of 2019. Using a metro ticket machine, make sure you indicate that your destination is Versailles Rive Gauche, a station. There are three destinations in Versailles, so you need to choose the right one. If you're worried about buying the incorrect ticket, purchase tickets from the metro service agent. Depending on your departure location, the train ticket will take you anywhere from 30 to 60 minutes, so plan accordingly. Insider tip, purchase both your tickets to and from Versailles while you're in Paris. If you buy your return ticket to Paris at the Versailles station, there will likely be dozens of other people doing the same thing and lines can get long. I've been filming all day and I need a break. Just a quick water break, but while I'm doing it, if you like this video, click the like button. If you love the video, hit subscribe and we get all of our content as soon as it comes out. Give me a second, okay, I'm thirsty. By bus. The Versailles Express bus departs near the Eiffel Tower. Purchasing a ticket on their site will get you a round trip bus ticket to Versailles and an entrance to the palace for 42 euros, or just a round trip ticket for 24 euros. But note that all their tickets are for half day transfers, so going to this route means you'll have limited time in the palace. A second bus option, bus 171, will take you to the palace from Pont de Seve area. Accessible by Metro Line 9, the cost of a normal ticket would be 1 euro 90 cents or 2 euros if you purchase on board the bus. This will be a minimum of a 30 minute ride. If you want to take all the guesswork out and arrange a visit to Versailles Palace, you can do so with our tour. Uh, we offer round trip transportation with train, a full tour of the area, tickets to get inside and entrance to the garden, so it's great. Opening hours for the Chateau of Versailles and its gardens differ depending on the time of year. In summer, expect more people and bigger crowds. Visit our blog for more information. So that's it, now you know how to get to Versailles from Paris. If you like this video, click the like button. If you love this video, subscribe to get all the content as soon as it comes out. Otherwise, au revoir. Ver, that, per, 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 oh, Versailles. That's cool. <laughs> so slimy.